Welcome to how to create PDF presentations using Adobe Photoshop's automation tools. So to start we go to File, Automate, PDF Presentation. Now on this first field is where we choose our files for our presentation. We can actually include all of these file formats listed here, including Photoshop files, 3D files, audio files, and so on. In our case, we will use a set of images. So next, we have some output options. Uh, we will choose presentation, which we will create a slides presentation. We can choose our background color, which we will set to black. And now we have this include option, uh, which lets us uh, make a caption for each file. Now, this information here comes from the files metadata, which we can check uh, if we open Adobe Bridge and select one or multiple images. We can check here in the metadata panel our metadata information and we can edit these metadata so it's the file information we want to appear on our presentation. For instance, we will set it to file name and extension and we will also activate title. So next we have some presentation options. This first option is the slides uh, time. And now we have the option to loop after a last pitch, which will create kind of an infinite loop. Once it's finished, it starts again. And then we can choose a transition. We'll set it to fade, which is right here. All right, so we can save now. All right, and now we have some standard PDF uh, options. We will set embed PDF page thumbnails. We can also downsample, downsample images. Uh, we, can, we have some output color options, security options, and so on. Now we will process all of the images. And let's see the result. So if we go to our presentation. Now if we open our presentation it will try to put it on full screen mode so we will allow it and here we have our presentation. Now notice that each caption actually has a different size. This is because it maintained the original file size to create this presentation and actually all of the captions have the same size, it just scales them accordingly to the file size. And so one way to solve this problem is to import all of the images to Photoshop, crop all of them to the same size, and then on the PDF presentation options add the open files and then create the presentation from there. And then it all of the uh, captions would have the same size. And so this is all. I hope you've enjoyed this quick explanation of, on how to create PDF presentations using Adobe Photoshop's automation tools.